Hi guys and welcome back here to Drone Emotion, a channel where we do drone videos and where we cover the most relevant drone news. Today my friends we're back here once again with breaking news for all of you all. And in today's video we have some breaking news regarding the DJI Air 2S. My friends it looks like some brand new specs that we were not expecting have been confirmed and in today's video we have all of this information for all of you you don't want to miss out on today's video my friends it's going to be an extremely extremely exciting one to say the least but before we get started if you're new to the channel welcome here and don't forget to hit that subscribe button because in this channel we will always be the first ones to bring you the latest drone news and also we're getting extremely close to 5,000 subscribers so if you're watching today's video and you haven't subscribed yet make sure you do so so that you can help us get to that 5,000 subscriber goal which we're very very close from so with that being said guys let's go ahead and dive right into today's video which is going to be a very very exciting one well in case you haven't been up to date with what has been going on in the drone world let me put you into context a little bit well a, a few weeks ago an FCC label was found and this confirms the arrival of a brand new DJI drone and this is going to be the third Mavic Air drone which is going to be called the DJI Air 2S and we have the FCC label right here on screen for all of you to see there we have it so whenever something like this happens we know that a DJI product is imminent in fact we're talking weeks before we actually get to see this drone officially announced well we have been talking a lot about the DJ Air 2 spot in today's video we have some brand new information that got leaked from some very reliable source so we can it's safe to say that this will most likely be happening with the DJ Air 2 so without any much further ado let's go ahead and get started so the first thing that we can confirm thanks to some very reliable sources is the fact that the DJI Air 2S will have an upgraded transmission system, okay? Just like what happened with the Mini 2 and the Mini 1, this is what you can expect with this drone. The drone will not suffer extreme, okay, an extreme makeover, but most of the changes are going to be on the inside of the drone as well as on the camera, okay? Now, the first thing is that the transmission system will be improved now to what will it be improved well the Mavic Air 2S which was released on May of last year okay utilized OcuSync 2.0 which gave us around six and a half miles or 10 kilometers of range now that technology is a bit old okay that was first introduced with the Mavic 2 Pro back in 2018 so it's almost three years old so it's time I think in my opinion that the for the new Mavic Air drone to have an upgraded transmission system. And well, it looks like that will be happening and the Mavic Air 2S will be using OcuSync 3.0, okay? This has already been used on the DJI FPV drone. We still get the same range, six and a half miles or 10 kilometers, okay? So that will not change, except DJI does some sort of software update just like what happened with the original Mavic okay 2 Pro which its original range was around four and a half miles and then two years later it received a software update and bumped it up to six miles okay so possibly we could be seeing around I don't know 12 kilometers or seven and a half to eight miles of range but that's not confirmed the range is not confirmed yet we just know Oxygen 3.0 will be happening and it's capable of doing 10 kilometers or six and a half miles okay and we we will be noticing a difference when it comes to a transmission we have seen it with the fpb drone it's a much stronger signal now let's go ahead and talk about what else is going to be happening with the air 2 as well b2 goggles are going to be compatible guys i'm very excited to share this with you it will be happening okay so the brand new b2 goggles were that were released a few weeks back by DJI, they will be compatible, so no need to worry about that, okay? Because you know that they're, they're compatible with Oculus 3.0, so with the Air 2 utilizing 3.0, they will be working together, okay? Now, okay, let's talk about one other thing, and that is going to be the size 
and shape of the drone. It will stay practically the same, okay? Just like what happened with the Mini 1 and the Mini 2, okay? We'll, the change on the outside will not be an extreme makeover. Maybe a slight change is like what happened with the Mini 2 when we got that little LED light at the front. So expect minor changes, nothing big, okay? Also, one other thing, we're going to be having top sensor so upward obstacle avoidance will be a thing and will be happening with the dji air 2s now will it be exactly the same like what we found it on the leaked prototype mavic air 2 which we have right here on the screen was a video that was leaked since November of last year, okay? This was supposed to be a Mavic Air 2 prototype. We don't know if this is going to be the Air 2S. In my opinion, I don't think it will be, but expect something similar. As you can see, those little twice on the front of the drone, that's upward obstacle avoidance. So we can confirm that will be happening. We don't know if it's going to be the, in the same place as what we see on that video, okay? But upward upward obstacle avoidance will be happening okay one other thing guys something very important okay the dji air 2s will not be c marked in europe i think this is something very big for all of you guys that are living in europe this is something important let me repeat that once again the air 2s will not be c marked in europe okay so that means that the DJI Air 2S, its weight will stay probably at around 576 grams, which is what this drone weighs, okay? So it looks like the Air 2S will not be a lighter drone. Okay, also, ATSB will be incorporated into all units of the Air 2S. Keep in mind that when the Mavic Air 2S was released, only the North American units had ATSB on board. Now, with the Air 2S, all of them worldwide will be having a DSB, so no need to worry about that, okay? And let's finish off strong with the last one, and the, in, my, in my opinion, the most exciting one, and that is the camera, okay? With this drone, the Mavic Air 2, we have a half-inch sensor camera, okay? It's a pretty good sensor, we get 4K 60, we even have 8K hyperlapse, okay, and 48 megapixel pictures. Now, the Air 2S, there was a speculation going around that a Sony IMX686 sensor was going to be utilized, okay, which had an impressive quality, but no, and that was a 1 over 1.7 inch sensor, okay, and that is the same size sensor that we find on the Osmo Pocket 2. A lot of people were afraid that it was going to be happening, but we can confirm that will not happen. And that is because it looks like a one inch sensor is going to be fitted onto the Air 2S. What do you think about that, guys? I think that's the best thing about the Air 2S. The camera, without a doubt, is going to be an absolute beast. I cannot wait to see its final product okay so those are the most exciting news guys a one inch sensor is confirmed and will be fitted onto the dji air 2s guys so that's all of the info that we have so far as soon as we have any more new leaks info more fcc labels pictures or anything regarding the air 2s we'll always be the first one to cover it here in this channel so that's gonna wrap up today's video guys thanks for watching and see you tomorrow with a brand new video drone emotion Signing out.